There's a certain type of food that people share when hanging out, when sharing a moment. And some people call it finger food, other people call it game day food. And for me, my favorite food out of, I guess, that like grouping of foods is chicken wings. However, this is a food that truly, it truly ranges in prices. One day you'll have an amazing 25 cent wing, and other days you'll have literally an epic, like mind-changing wing from a restaurant. So today we'll be eating chicken wings from cheap to expensive, finding which wing comes at the best value. Uh, every time I start one of these cheap versus expensive challenges, I just get so excited because I know that the cheap place is most likely, probably, going to be in Chinatown. Chinatown is without a doubt New York City and Manhattan's best place to find cheap eats. And right now I'm not only going to one of my favorite chicken wing places, but also food places in general in New York City. You have a, a chicken wing? Chicken wing? Yeah. No more. No more? Ah, okay. So the place that I was going to get chicken wings at here supposedly doesn't have any more. So now I have to check out this craziness here to try to find some. You have a chicken wing? Chicken wing? Chicken wing. Inside? Okay, yeah, yeah, thank you. Chicken yeah, chicken wing, yeah. Thank you. They said no more over there. Yeah, so yeah, I, I looked around, finally found it. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, now one of the mainstream beliefs that I completely disagree with is that cheap wings are best at bars. Usually people are going to bars that are promoting like 50 cent wings or like 25 cent wings. But for me, always, these wings, they're very underperforming in flavor. And not to mention, usually you do have to buy a drink to accompany that. So those 50 cent wings usually turn into something like a dollar. So for me, the cheap wings mecca comes at the market in Chinatown. These wings come at $5.99 per pound or 38 cents per wing. Now the thing about these wings that are different from normal chicken wings is they're actually first stewed with mushroom and then fried, making for a perfect caramelized crust on the outside. Oh yum. That is literally the perfect way to start off the cheapest expensive chicken wing. You see what comes with these chicken wings compared to normal, like say bar or cheap wings in New York City is these things are 100% fresh. Within the market there's butchers and people that are literally cutting the chicken wings as you walk. You know, and I don't wanna knock cheap chicken wing places, but to be honest, they usually don't have a unique flavor. Because this is first made in the stew and then fried, the flavor is one unique and also bombing. So skip the happy hour spots and go to Chinatown. All right, so for medium, I feel like this is kind of where most of the chicken wings fall into. This wing, it's one that's definitely not cheap, but there's definitely a higher quality there. So right now I'm headed to a place that's literally a staple for the lower part of Manhattan. Could I just have a uh, five-piece traditional? What flavor would you like? Medium would be good, yeah, medium. Have a good hit. Okay, so one thing that's different about a medium place comparable to a cheap place is the sauce. At the Chinese market, there was literally no sauce on the wing, which made for a bit of a bare flavor. So here I went with the traditional five wings topped with their medium sauce. Just smelling these, they seem to be on like the spicier side for their medium sauce. And personally, I love spice, so I'm pretty excited for this. Wow, oh man, that is good. It's got a bit of a kick to it. At first bite, always in a wing, you're looking for like that crunch, that lightly fried taste, but also the meat is juicy and tender. Now for me, the thing about chicken wings that kind of brings everything together is the sauce. The sauce can literally make or break a chicken wing. Sometimes you get a wing that, yes, is nicely spiced, but also just way too overbearingly hot. And on the other spectrum, you get a wing that sometimes doesn't really have that much flavor to it. The sauce isn't really anything to write home about. However, it does go well with the juicy meat. Now, now let's talk the value of these wings. I got five wings for $9, which is $1.80 per wing. And to be honest, that price, that's pretty expensive. So although the taste is quite good with the cooked through tender meat and the pretty mild sauce, I'm not convinced for the value. A wing that's not only delicious, but absolutely gourmet. A wing that has literally a secret recipe. You see, the place we're going to right now for the expensive wing, they don't just do good wings. They do incredible, like one of the best barbecues across New York City. Oh, um, I'm just picking up. Go. Thank you so much. Yeah, have a good one. You too. Oh man, I'm not gonna lie, but when I did think of this wing challenge, I directly thought of blue smoke. And that's because these wings have the weird combination of an incredible, like award-winning sauce with some of the best barbecue that you're gonna taste, not only in wings, but in New York City. This is a six-piece smoked wing set with tangy Alabama sauce. If I said that I was waiting to eat these all day, it would be, <laughs> it would be a quite an understatement. Also, before eating, I'm on one of the more like New York and unique kind of tables and seats set us across New York. That's what happens when your entire city is constantly under construction.
Oh my god. That wing is tremendous. Like, honestly, I don't know where to begin. The char on that wing is literally perfect. Honestly, it's so perfect that when you bite into the wing, you think that you're gonna have, like, a dry meat inside. But that meat is literally dripping with juice. Like, I mean, just look at that thing. If there was an example for a wing, like, what it should look on the inside, blue smoke, you have achieved it. Wow. Wow. I mean... Wow, that Alabama sauce, it makes this wing amazing to just, I, I don't even know, like a 12 out of 10. Now it's hard to define the taste of this Alabama sauce, but let me, let me just give it a try. So it looks to have like kind of a base of mayonnaise, making for a bit of a rich flavor. But also within that sauce, there's definitely a bunch of miso, making for almost like a tanginess to it. So you have rich tangy with that tender meaty taste, which I didn't know until this moment just go incredibly amazingly well with each other now as i'm sitting here just destroying these wings let's talk about the value here so in the dish you get six wings for 13 dollars so about two dollars and 16 cents per wing which definitely is an incredibly high price for a wing however and this is the thing that sets these wings apart from the last two that we've eaten today it comes from a restaurant that literally specializes in meat so for me these wings they're on a completely different level like this is a freaking massive wing like that is literally like a block of chicken wing. And if I'm gonna compare these wings with the 38 cent and the $1.40 wing, there's absolutely no doubt in my mind that blue smoke wings come at the best value. Oh, hello again. Yes, I did pick the expensive plate, but which one do you guys think was best? Go cast your vote on my Instagram and I'll see you guys next time.